Hello and welcome back to the Graceful Tangle YouTube channel. I'm Amy Kate and I am so pumped to make this video because I am hosting and announcing in this video my very first make along. This is going to be such a fun way to kick off this new year of 2022. I cannot believe it's 2022, but it's going to be a fabulous year. I have really big expectations and one of them is going to be this, hosting my very first make along. It's going to be amazing. So the rules of this make along are super simple. It is going to be dishcloths. We're just going to make dishcloths throughout the year. The challenge is to make one dishcloth every single week. If you keep up with that, you'll have 52 dishcloths at the end of the year, which is absolutely crazy. But I think it's going to be a really fun way to bust through a cotton stash if you have one. If you don't have a stash of cotton yarn, you can maybe purchase some from multiple companies and see what you like best. Um, you can make any patterns you'd like. And then dishcloths are such useful items and practical for any household. So they make amazing gifts. They last for years to come. I myself love using them. I'm going to build my self stash for the future. I'm going to give some to my mom throughout the year and then of course save them for gifts as well. So I'm really pumped about this. Now like I mentioned, the rules are really simple. They really aren't any. I want this to be really flexible, really, really simple. I have designed and released two new patterns, one knit and one crochet dishcloth. They're really basic and meant with the beginner but also advanced maker in mind. Um, like I said, one knit and one crochet. So this is of course open to knitters and crocheters alike. I will link those um, patterns and full video tutorials down in the description box below if you want to check those out. We will also have a hashtag on Instagram. So if you use the hashtag TGT, which stands for the Graceful Tangle. So TGT Dishcloth Mal, make along, um, on, on Instagram. If you use that hashtag and tag me, I would love to show your creations. But then there's also going to be a Facebook group that you can join. So that is going to be a really special way to build a community around this make along. Um, again, I want to just make it very clear that this is open to knitters and crocheters. So please, um, any maker out there, I would love, love to have you in this Facebook group. So I will put the link to that in the description box below. You can join in, you can show your progress, you can share each and every dishcloth you make or you can save your post for a while and just share them all at once whatever works for you um again i think it's going to be a really amazing way to just build a little bit of a community around this make along now it lasts from january 1st 2022 to december 31st 2022 so it's going to be a year long um like i said you can make a dishcloth a week that's what i'm going to try to do myself but you can make however many dishcloths you want. Like, it's just going to be super flexible. Um, you can use any dishcloth pattern out there. I have designed these two patterns. Um, this crochet corner to corner dishcloth that features the half double crochet stitch. But then also this dishcloth, which is also corner to corner. And it's knit using the garter stitch. Um, so I have designed both of these patterns to go along with this make along. Um, specifically, they are both very simple. So it's really awesome to get in the habit of kind of making the same dishcloth because then it's really easy to just do it once a week and that's exactly my plan but there's also so many amazing dishcloth patterns out there i have a few more of my own that i've released in the past um i actually have an entire dishcloth collection that i launched in spring of 2020 and then i updated all of those patterns in 2021 with video tutorials and new pdfs so you can find all of those patterns in my ravelry and etsy shops um and then, like I said, there's also so many other amazing dishcloth patterns by other designers as well that you are, of course, more than welcome to make and then join in this, uh, this make-along. I almost said knit-along. It's a make-along. It's really hard. I'm used to saying cow or K-A-L knit-along, but this is a make-along. It's open to knitters and crocheters alike again. So anyways, um, it's going to be a year long, like I mentioned. Now, I wanted to make a note and share some of my favorite cotton yarns. There are so many out there. I am by no means going to cover them all. Um, my absolute favorite that I have found is Knit Picks or We Crochet. They're sister companies. Um, their Dishy line is my all-time favorite. I really love Dishy. It's really soft and nice to work with. It's not hard on your hands like some other cottons can be. Um, and the colors last a really long time, so it takes forever for them to fade, which is really, really nice. Um, so their Dishy line is my favorite. They have Dishy Solids, Dishy Twist, um, Dishy Multi. Like, there are so many awesome lines. Um in the dishy line so that's my favorite but then i also love i love this cotton from hobby lobby 
um, Lily's Peaches and Cream, I think might be what it's called. I've used that many times. Um, Sugar and Cream is another really good one. Lion Brand. Pima Cotton is a great one. There's so many amazing cottons. Um, I myself prefer using cotton for dishcloths. I think it holds up the best. You can also wash and dry it in the dry in the washer and dryer like normal laundry. So that's really nice. They're super easy to care for. Um, but you can use any blend that you want. Acrylic, there's nothing wrong with it. It's not, you know, up at the top of my list of suggestions. Um, once again, I prefer cotton but for, for this project. But really, you can use anything you like. Anything is going to be amazing. And I would love to have you join us. So I hope you're excited about this. I am so pumped to be hosting my very first make-along. Um, it's going to be very relaxed, very chill. I'll be posting about it frequently on Instagram throughout the year, sharing my dish calls that I'm going to be making. I will show y'all's if you use the hashtag and tag me. Um, but then also the Facebook group will be active throughout the entire year. And so you are welcome to join in. Again, that link is down in the description box below, as well as the patterns, tutorials for the patterns, um, and then my favorite cotton yarns or link as well if you need to fill up your stash a little bit. So, I'm really pumped about this. Again, I hope you are too. Um, yeah, I think it's going to be a really, really amazing year. So, thank you so much for watching. I would love to hear your thoughts about this. Leave a comment down below or send me an email to thegracefultangle at gmail.com with your thoughts. And join in the Facebook group if that's your thing. I think it's going to be super, super fun. Thank you so much for watching and I cannot wait to see your dish calls. Until next time, happy making. Bye. <laughs>